Today is Friday, September 7th. I'm Alexis. And I'm Vince. And welcome to Nightline Newscast. Hey Knights, last Wednesday we had a back to school night and it was a great success. That's right, I heard there was over 100 students and parents that showed up. That has great things happening at this school. You're right, Valverde is a great school with a lot of programs for you students to get involved in. Also, there are some pretty amazing teachers here. Mr. Hallian, Mr. Jefferson, Mrs. Hurtado, just to name a few. And that is why they call Val a motto Continuation High School. Now here's some school news. Hey Knights, mark your calendars. ASVAB is scheduled for September 25th and February 19th, 2019. This aptitude assessment is for all students so that you can use the data to educate yourself about careers, training, and education. Students can even prepare for the ASVAB with practice questions at this site on the screen. Go to asvabprogram.com, select resources at the top of the page, scroll down to testing resources in the left column, select sample PNP ASVAB test questions. Hey guys, here's a new club. LGBTQ Plus Club is having a meeting next Wednesday after school in room 203 from 1130 to 12 p.m. It's a safe place for anybody in the queer community. Anyone is welcome. Now, Mrs. Kubota is our ASV teacher, and now here she is with some ASV news for us. Good morning, Knights. This is Mrs. Kubota, the ASV director at Valverde High School. Um, welcome back to our year. Um, so I have some things that I would like to uh, share with you, but the most important one to top it off is our blood drive. Our blood drive is September 17th, and you'll see the ASB students coming around uh, to take down your name if you are interested. If you are 16 years old, you will need a permission slip, so we will also have those available for you. Uh, seniors, if you choose to do the blood drive, please know that this is the only um, community service that we will have. ASB does not do very many community service um, projects. This is one of the community service that we do. Um, you will get two hours for the just a regular blood donation and then three hours for your Alex machine. Other things we would have wrapped up hopefully a very successful club rush and we are looking forward to seeing all your clubs being run out um, on campus and um, enjoying our Val Verde High School spirit. This year's senior hoorah is going to be at Universal uh, Grad Bash, and so you'll see tickets going on sale for that. Um, senior spirit shirts, senior lanyards, all that stuff will be up and running soon, and we will see us out in the quad because we're gonna have you vote for the senior class, and then we will print those for you. Are you interested in buying Dippin' Dots? We may be bringing those here pretty soon. Um, they're a healthy version, but watch for it at the Student Store. Again, the Student Store is open Monday, Tuesday, Thursday, and Friday. Um, and we sell snacks, and we sell backpacks, and lanyards, and uh, school shirts. Um, and see us if you would like to also participate in ASB. We will have applications um, in room 308. And thank you, and welcome nights, and enjoy your year. Thank you, Mrs. Kubota. Mrs. Kubota also wants you to know that an Army rep will be here at Val this Tuesday, September 11th. So if you are interested in talking with him, please sign up with Mrs. Kubota ASAP. Now here is Mr. McCarrick, who wants to tell you some more imp important school information. Good morning, Valverde High Knights. There's not much coming from Guidance Office this week, but I do have some announcements. One, progress reports are coming up. If you have tests in your classrooms, make sure you work hard, turn in your assignments, and do well on the test, because those progress report grades will be sent home to your families. Two, if you have started credit recovery, make sure you attend, you can't miss more than two days. For credit recovery seniors, it's Mondays, Tuesdays, and Thursdays, 2.30 to 4.30. Lastly, for my seniors graduating in October, 
We will start FASFA in the first week of October. So look out for announcements for FASFA workshops with Mr. Vlastos and myself. We will call you in and make sure you get your FASFA completed so you can graduate in October without any issues. Again, Knights, have a great weekend. Thank you, Mr. McCarrig. Hey students, do you need to earn some elective units or you seniors out there need to get your community service hours? Well, join Teen Vision and you can earn elective credits or community service hours by helping us film our various high school football games. To join, please talk with Mr. Jonathan Nunez in 104. Now here is this week's weather with Ty. Hey Valverde Knights, I'm Ty, and here's your week's weather forecast. Beginning today is going to be a hot 98 degrees and is going to stay hot all weekend. Saturday, we're expected to reach 100 degrees, and Sunday will be a high 97. Tch. Watch me be in the house this weekend, though. The beginning of the week, Monday, we will start to see a light cool down with a high of 95. Tuesday is going to be a high 94 degrees, which follows Wednesday, a high 93. Thursday might be the longest day, but good news to you guys is going to be 90 degrees, which is the lowest this week has had. Hopefully we'll start seeing a cool down in this weather. This is Ty. Hopefully everyone has a great weekend. Stay hydrated and cool. See you soon, Knights. Thank you, Ty. Now let's go to Vince who has some more school news. Thank you, Alexis. Hey, Knights. You know what's cool? Be cool by becoming an ROP Pharmacy Tech. This class is taught by our ROP teacher, Miss Armenta, and is a one year long class. At the end of the class, which includes 200 hours class time, and 120 of hands-on externship training, students are eligible to apply for a pharmacy techni technician license through the California State Board of Pharmacy. For more information, please talk with our school counselor or Ms. Armenta in room 406. Now here is the one and only Coach Martin. Guess what, we're back, it is week number four. You know what that means? That's right. Progress reports next week. What? So you got progress reports coming up next week. That's going to be week five. This is week number four. And guess what? Stay focused. Now, what does that mean for the teachers? Great books got to be up. What does that mean for you students? That means your eyes got to be up. Your head's got to be up. You got to pay attention. You have midterms coming up. Your papers need to be turned in. Seniors, you got to be focused. Remember, you're running out of time. There's no time left. Get your work done. <sighs> and talking about getting your work done, what about O, V, R, V, and C, H? All teams in the Valverde Unified School District are undefeated in their class of football. And this Friday, that's right, is the inaugural game, the first home game as they go against El Monte. It's going to be the battle of the double wing teams. It's going to be fun. If you get a chance, go out to OOV. Watch this game. It's going to be great. And I really wish the best for Coach Zomold over there and for OV. The Coyotes are howling their way in. So again, Coyotes are 2-0 right now. Looking to push the 3-0. Let's go get them, Coyotes. And what about your Valverde night? <laughs> Valverde will be starting softball season next week. Stay, more, stay in tune to more exciting stuff coming from that. And remember, guys, you need to get your physicals in. <laughs> no rest for Physical forms are passed out. We got to get them turned back in. And from there, who knows what's going to happen. We have volleyball that's also coming up. Stay focused, do what you're supposed to be doing. Valverde softball, that's gonna start next week. From there you have the inaugural game and that is going to be OV versus El Monte at Orange Vista High School. And again, Prox reports is coming up on the fifth. Hello, hello. Stay focused and stay true to yourselves. We're out, talk to you later. Thank you, Coach Martin. Hey Knights, please remember that there will be a blood drive Monday, September 17 in the gym. Help save a life by donating blood. Now here is Ms. Aribe with the Portsmouth School information on PBIS. 
Hey guys, it's Miss Suribe here. Um, I've been asked to talk about PBIS um, and what it means for our school. So here I go. Um, PBIS stands for Positive Behavior Intervention Support System. So it's essentially if you're following our values, you know, our vision, attitude, and learning, um, you're going to get rewarded and you're going to start receiving what we call VV Bucks, which we're going to have. Um, on Fridays, you're going to be able to come redeem them for goodies during lunch. Um, so start looking out for that. Um, we're going to start giving them out at back to school night. So make sure you're coming with your, your parents, your grandparents, your older siblings, cousins, tias, tios, whoever it is that you want to bring so that you can receive VV Bucks and you can start getting rewarded for following and demonstrating your values every single day. Um, other than that, just you know, keep being awesome nights and you know, have a great day. Thanks, Mr. Rebe. Hey, did you know we have an acting class for all you want to be actors and actresses out there? Learn from a professional, Mr. Walt Taylor. And last but not least, here at Val, we make movies. Yes, you heard it right. If you want to learn how to make movies, please talk to Mr. Del Campo. Join his class or just talk with our school counselor for more details. On a serious note, there will be a school-wide assembly on October 23rd. We will be having a guest speaker, a Paul Singleton, who will be sharing important information on a very serious matter that is affecting many teens throughout the world, that is sex trafficking. And that's it for today's news show. The Nightline News will be shown every Friday during advisory period. And like or subscribe on our YouTube channel, BBUSD Teen Vision. I'm Vince. And I'm Alexis, so stay safe and we'll see you next week on our new show. We're signing out, so until next time, same night time. And the same night channel. Bye. <laughs> Deuces. <laughs>We now return control of your television set to you until next week at the same time when the control voice will again take over. Until then, please stand by.